I'm about uh, probably a week into the project here, working on our house, which is a never ending battle it seems. But uh, this time we had a small leak that's been on the front porch since we bought it. The previous owners uh, said they'd knock off 80 bucks for some, uh, some roof ceiling so we can fix our leak, which uh, inevitably led to me cutting out the porch because I found that the, uh, that the foundation had actually collapsed, causing the roof line to sag, causing water to stand in certain parts of the roof. As you can see here now, I've actually went back and put another faceboard in uh, because of all the other had dry rotted, termite damage, water damage, and I actually had to climb underneath this much of a space which I don't know if you can see that underneath there, but it's probably about a foot and a half clearance. Uh, I'm not a little bitty guy, but to squeeze into that uh, was not easy. Um, and now I'm having to replace floor joists on the right side of the house, which everything over here had pretty much deteriorated, as you can see. Just rot. They built a house on top of an old foundation and they did a half ass job of trying to build this house. You can see the rot here. I can just reach right in and chip it away with my hand. It's, it's so bad. Termite damage. Uh, so I'm going back in, replacing all the floor joists. And I have about a foot and a half of clearance to do that. So what I'm having to do actually is rip up the hardwood floors and one of the uh, the front bedrooms of the house and you can see here not a pretty sight damage 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 I actually took a skill saw and cut this subfloor out just to be able to get in here and you can see how much room we have clearance to to move around in here and it uh, it's about about the height of a hammer That's about all the room we've got to work over here. I've actually been chucking away at this. I gotta break out the old, and you can see how that just fell apart. And put new in. Whew. This is a pain in the ass. And hopefully, you first time homeowners will not have to run into the same problem that. I've had to run in and deal with for the past seven years of home ownership. That being said, I will keep you up to date with progress uh, as we move forward. Wish me luck.